Sir. What's good, y'all? It's your boy Bad C, aka Nicholas Cage, aka Larry J. Blige, aka your mother's baby father. Yo, we back with another episode of your favorite song where I sit down with your favorite artists and producers and I ask them, what's your favorite song, B? But today, this is a special episode, man. I just dropped the album. The album is called Four Figure Ring. Make sure y'all go check that shit out. It's on Bandcamp right now. It's going to be on all the streamers on July 21st. Make sure y'all go get that. But it ain't my album, man. It ain't. It's got a talented cast of producers on there that is crazy, and I want y'all to get to know them. Two of them couldn't make it today. Those two, Take Notes and CJ Dog, salute to y'all. See y'all at the crossroads. But right now, on the show, we got my man Freak Show from Ohio, right? We got my sis Murder Mags, and we got Team motherfucking demo in the building. Word up. What's good, y'all? What's good, y'all? <laughs> <Like, laughs> like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, so, what's I happening, want, y'all? Word. First off, I want to thank y'all for, for coming on the show so we could talk about this album that, that people, it seemed like people fucking with. You know what I'm saying? So I want to kind of break down from y'all, what y'all favorite songs are on the joint. And then, you know, we could talk about a little bit of the process or whatever, and then I'll tell y'all what my favorite joints are on the app. You know what I'm saying? So, first off, I want to start with Team Demo. You know what I'm saying? I want to start with y'all, because we got the longest relationship. You know what I'm saying? Now, it's bugged out, because I was just telling somebody the other day the story, how I linked with y'all, and um, how me and Jay was in a hip hop group, just bugging out, just tripping off everybody. We, we, we saw a lot of things the same way, and we laughing at a lot of the same people and all that. Then we end up developing the, the musical relationship, right? So I wanna, I wanna ask y'all. Being that we've done so much work together, it, do, does it feel, uh, 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 do y'all become desensitized when you get records? Like, is it now like, oh, well, I, like, whatever. Or is it still the same excitement from when we first started? Like, what y'all think about that? I <laughs> <laughs> you gotta speak up too, bro. I can't really hear you. Nah, nah. It's always exciting when you pick a beat. Just like earlier in the conversation, I was already yeah. like, this. "Nah, nah." We always looking for it. After a while, it's like we need a chord, bro. You know what I mean? <laughs> but, but you know how we is. It's just, bro. Yeah. Especially, yeah. you just kept hitting them out the park. Like this, this whole run, crazy. Yeah, everything. February, like always, I can to see what you pick and what you create out of it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Like what you bring to it, it's like, oh, okay. Yeah. Now it's you know everything coming. It's supposed to be. You know. Feels yeah. Right. Yeah. Um, yeah. Particularly on this album. With the other producers, some of the you know, we haven't done on our tracks. So yeah, kind of excites me a little more to see you get you know more well, well, well rounded and broader with your with your style and everything you know, and like you know the topics and everything. Absolutely well put together. Like in the whole run, how you organize all the songs back to back, you know, very well. Yeah. Put together. Uh, Nah, good looking out. Nah, I agree. I think I think it's 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 sort of like it feels like like I now when I talk about it, I want to take myself out of it because I don't want to make it seem like oh this guy, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm talking about it as as a fan of yeah. of, of hip hop music, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm not saying it is this album, but it gives me me 
a illmatic vibe. Just the vibe of it, of it, of it just being like just straight through, and it, you know, the only the only difference is you know, Sun had a feature on that. You know what I'm saying? To me, that's like the only the only real difference. Um, it, it felt that way with the cohesiveness with the production, and you know, it, it, it felt like y'all as a whole productive production unit felt like. Um, that Illmatic squad, like that's what it felt like to me. You know what I'm saying? So I wanna, I wanna ask Meg. So even for you, like, like with you coming into the fold, man. I think, I think the first joint we did that came out was with Big Cell, right? That was on the, um, that was on the the, the self titled joint. Am I right? Yeah, that was the the first joint we did. Yep, you're right. It was the uh, Bake Sale and Uber, actually. But, of course, yeah, it Uber. started off with Bake Sale. Yeah. So, now, for you, like, you... Now, with, with Team Demo being at the helm of it, like, you you pretty much know that when, when an album is being formed, like, Team Demo is, is like, that. They're, they're going to lay the bricks. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, like, like you know that, but you always tend to like you, you, I think you, you got to a point where you're laying bricks that they might, it's, it's almost like, it's, it's almost like you're a, another member of team demo. Like that, it, it, that's what it feels like. Like it feels like if they forget something or just, if they're just like, they might not have got to it. You feel that slotting. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's crazy. It's crazy. How, how is it? Well, what do you, how do you feel about Team Demo as, as producers? Like, what do you think about their production style and, and, and what they bring to the table? Production style, crazy. Crazy. Just what I'm, you know, what I was heading for. Of course, I, I've heard of Team Demo, of course, um, when they had made the 50 Cent joint. Which I didn't yeah. even know up until I said, oh, oh for real? I looked at it, I said, for real? Wow, That's them? That they get me down too, like man. that? So, um, yeah, I, I said, okay, I definitely got to step my game up. So, yeah, they they really got me. They got me on it, you know? They, they really got me getting on my shit. And, you know, I, I definitely appreciate them. I, I appreciate them so much that yeah. I actually, you know, get to step it up and all the other stuff like that. So, yeah, I got yeah. to th- give thanks to Team Demo. Nah, no doubt. Like I definitely, I definitely um the the sound is definitely that that shit. And I think I think that you fit perfectly in there. And and it's crazy because when they find out that you're a woman doing doing those those hard tracks, like it's it's crazy. Like they're like, what? I'd be like, yeah, my sis, man. My sis did that, man. Niggas be tripping, so you know. Salute to you now. Now, freak show. Now, you, you're like the sleeper because I always say this. Like I'm like my my core sound is actually the sound that you make. You know what I'm saying? That is my core sound. But you know what I'm saying? Like I've adopted this Diddy Bob style. You know what I'm saying? I've adopted this. And, and um what you do seems to complement that, you know, like it, it does because what, what happens is is it's so quirky. It's so it's it, it's really it's really quirky and, and it all it, it bounces off of the the menace, which is what what Megs and Team Demo does, yours is menacing, but it's almost like a circus clown, like a freak show. Okay. Like it's crazy. Like, like it's, 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 some, it's some fucking crazy shit. What what do you to me, you got the sleeper joint on the album. And and it's four finger ring part two. A lot of people talk about that record. Now I'm gonna talk about that record in a second. But for you, 
what what is it what what runs through your brain when you're creating for the projects like when i tell you when i'm like yo we about to it's a go well what do you think like immediately like what's the first thing coming to your mind shit i gotta i gotta have some hard drums uh yeah gotta have a sick bass line um yeah should uh Gotta be raw, you know, pretty much. That's 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 pretty much it. And uh, you know, when I listen, when I was listening to you, uh, like like say some shit like uh, take my belt, your belt off. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. When I hear shit like that, it just inspires me. So when I when I hear that style, it fits right in with what I'm what I've been doing all these years too. So you know, I never strayed away from the that the, the real hip hop shit. You know what I'm saying? A lot of niggas been on that down south, the that right. mumble. And that trap music, I can't stand that shit, you know. But <laughs> so when I hear real MC, it, that shit just just motivates me. And you yeah. a bad fuck, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yes. So salute to you, salute to Team Demo, man, because all y'all beasts, y'all monsters, man. And I'm I'm glad to be a part of it. Glad to work. Glad out. For real, that's real shit. You got that funk shit, huh? Yeah. Funky shit. Thank you, bro. Appreciate it. Where, where are you from? I'm from Springfield, Ohio. Ohio? Yeah. Yeah, I hear, I hear, I hear that. Yeah. We uh, same, same, same little spot John Legend from. Yeah, indeed. I think I know, you know, that's only a uh, other person doing music around here like that, but so that's it. Funky. I just thought, now, now check it. I just started a new job, right? Oh. So I'm in training. I'm, I'm in training at this job, right? So we we can't even be on our phones. We're not supposed to be on our phones. Now, due to COVID, we're all sitting at our desk apart from each other, and we're in a Zoom meeting like this. That that's what we're doing. So if you're looking down, they could see that you're looking down. I was going to the studio that night. It's Friday, that just passed. I was going to the studio that night. I knew I needed one more record, and I needed a freak show record. I knew the beat. I couldn't play the beat at my desk at work. I knew it, though. It was in my head. Yo, bro, this is the first rap I ever wrote. Well, not ever. The first rap I wrote on a paper in years. Bro, I'm sitting there writing, looking down like this, so that they don't see me looking down. I wasn't writing in my phone like I usually do. But I was frying like I was taking notes. Like I was like, I would put the pen up like this, and I would go like this, but I was writing. I wrote it in like 10 minutes, bro. Heard the beat, knew from the flow, how I wanted to do it. Went to the studio that night and did it, bro. It last record in the house. <laughs> <laughs> so look uh, for you, bro. Uh, wow. So I want to get down to the nitty gritty. What happened? I said that, mo that motherfucker went together, though. Yeah, 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 it did. It did. Now I want to get down to the nitty gritty. You know, I know, I know it's late. I want to get y'all up out of here. I want to, I want to talk about first. I'm gonna tell y'all what my favorite joint on the, on that joint is. Now it's tough because I like every record on it. I love every record on it. And I'm just going to cheat and I'm going to say all of them. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to say all of them. Um, I, 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 I got, I got, a, I got an, an affinity for well I got an affinity for a couple and Ten Toes Down is one because that's the first record that I, I think that I did for the project. And it really, it really meant something, you know what I'm saying, to me. Um, Bill and Fame, because Megs, that's our thing. You know what I'm saying? We doing the duo thing on every, you know, we did P and Have on the last one. So now we got Bill and Fame, you know what I'm saying? And, uh -huh. And four finger ring part two, you know what I'm saying? And 
when the other producers was in here, I would have one from them. You know what I'm saying? As, as well, you, you know, um, it's that kind of an album. You, you know, it's that kind of an album. So I'm gonna flip it on y'all, and I'm gonna start with Mags. Mags, what's your favorite joint on the album? Four Finger Ring, and you can say it, joint you did too. It's all good. Okay? You can say. It. Wow. Um... Either it's between Bill and Fame or the first day of school. Those are my first two. But to knock one, I would say Bill and Fame. Because the beat is crazy on there. I love it. And the way it was all put together, um, as far as like the scratches and cuts, it was just, it, everything was just right. It was laid out right. So I would say Bill and Fame. Everything came so together. You, 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 you know what, sis? I think that's how we should do this. I think y'all should say, Y'all should pick two. Y'all should say, what was y'all favorite beat that you produced? And then the other beat is a, a song that you like that you didn't produce. I mean, from the Paris You know, no. that, that make it. Make. So, so, man, if you had to pick one that you didn't do, what would it be? You talking to us? Nah, to Meg. No, we were saying to Meg. Yeah, we was just letting Meg know that that's Tom's favorite. Bill and Fame joint is one of my favorites. Yeah, that's one of his favorites, too. Y'all just been on a show with Dan was so hard. It's like, and I like the visual. Yeah, little visual with MOP. Like, on point, that's been a real solid series and had a disappointment. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 But yeah, if if there's one track, well, I, I, I wish I would I would like to you know I don't like to compare nothing to anything because I don't want to you know be bashful or nothing like that. But there's one in particular. It's just be true. That's the one that actually stood out to me. Those one one of the tracks, even t- Team Demos, the Alchemist was the was the one that stood out to me too. So I would say two of those tracks really stood out to me. You know, those are the ones that really hit. But let me see. And I, I don't like that. <laughs> you told me to pick one, and I'm choosing three, four, and five that damn near the whole album. So excuse me. So yeah, those. That, but I would say just be true. That 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 stood out the most. So so Pearson, Y'all can't hear him. I can't hear. Yeah. Yeah. So, what's your favorite joint on the album? Uh, you talking to us? Ah, uh, free show. Oh, free show. Sorry. Man, that shit changed. That stay with me, man, with that shit, man, because. It's like trying to pick something off it, of, like you said, like picking something off of Illmatic. Like, what? Let me see. Uh, I gotta say, uh, Bill and Fame, and uh, what's the one? <laughs> Damn, man. It's tough. I know it was tough, man. Four finger ring, too. Hey, you can't, you can't, can't go wrong. You can't yeah. go wrong. All right, all right. So, so now, last but not least, as he's rolling the split up, Team Demo, what's your favorite record? Now, Tone said Bill and Fame. Yeah, that was one of his favorites. That's one of my favorites. You know, oh, but, well, you see, it picked out the Like, all the, all the records, of course, you know, I'm not going to, you know, I'm not going to suck you too hard, but, you know. <laughs> <laughs> every, every, every record is pretty fucking. You know, I can't stand Jay, man. Jesus Christ. <laughs> the one that really, really stood, stood out, you know, I know a lot of people like, uh, 
Bill and Fame. I love that too. So I want people to think I don't. But Bloody Rain stood out a lot to me. That's oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Bloody Rain. I, 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 I was. Yeah. I did. I wish I thought of that one. Uh, first day of school, I love yeah. Love me some first day. Of uh, uh, makes, uh, it's just it's just that's team level feel to it. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? And my third would be the happiness, and not because it's us, fuck us. It's more what that represents is to me what the bad seed is. I mean, mm-hmm. like, I, 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 as a function, when we say bad seeds, you know what I mean? Like, like, like the actual, the ditty bop. The movement, the, the sound, the movement, you've been rocking with us for like, you know, since Kill Switch. Yeah. I mean, that record is serious. Those are my three top threes out of all the tops. The top, 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 you know, all you already right. know. Oh, I can't wait for that one. Mm. I <laughs> it up. But yeah, man. So, so look, I want to thank y'all for for tuning in, man. This was this was really really dope. Um, there was a lot of records that were not mentioned, but I want to give honorable mentions to shit like February six and shit like uh. Uh, beautiful mind and uh, uh, four finger ring part one. Uh, she gang gang. February February That's what I was. I was that's that's so hard, bruh. No, I, no, I can't wait to perform that. Oh yeah, the intro, the intro is crazy, man. Yo, if y'all have not checked out Four Finger Ring, I suggest y'all go check it out. It's a really yeah. dope album. I'm, I'm not just saying that because we did it. You know what I'm saying? The album is crazy. Um, and salute to everybody on here. Uh, what y'all got coming? Let everybody know what y'all got coming. Team Demo, I know y'all got the album. Tell them about that. Free show, Mags. Let them know what y'all got going on. Oh, I got the third beat tape coming soon. I had to put that on hold because I was going to school at the time. It was supposed to be released back in September, October-ish. But um, I had put that on hold. So it's still coming. I had to uh, wipe everything, I guess, start up, start over, clean slate with some fresh new beats. Um, so that's coming soon. Um, I got some stuff with some other artists that I don't want to name. I just want to make sure that everything is good and, you know, just get the official dates and everything like that. So, yeah, um, of course, you um, and some other artists anonymously. But, um, okay. yeah, everything is coming okay. soon. All right, all right. Freak show. Shit, man, I ain't got shit going on. <laughs> I'm about my fucking court. <laughs> no, just- no, I hear that. Nah, nah, but you go. Nah, you won't be good with that. Yeah, you hey, good with that. Man, I'm just working, man. I ain't, you know, I ain't really doing too much, man. It's day to day. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up. And team demo. I know y'all. You know y'all got the record that y'all just did for Jesus. You know what I'm saying? I know that shit is hard. You feel me? And, and <laughs> y'all just did a record for Jesus. Y'all doing records for you know. Oh, <laughs> I mean, Jesus. what we got really coming through that. Um, oh, the, well, strictly for my people. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's the new single that's out there. Yo, I saw that. I think I saw that. I think right. I saw that. And how that was, we still got a mix like two joints that are going to be part of this week. We waiting for Dom to bring back the hard work. It's a demo. Uh, I am one. Yeah. Can't case. wait. I can't wait. Can't wait. Can't wait. Word up. All right. Well, what's yeah. is, what's up? This is the crazy thing. Once you turn the record, the, the album is still going to be That's what's crazy. You're breaking up real bad. That's that's what's crazy. <laughs> you breaking up bad. Like, it's hard yeah. to really hear you. Because of the you hear me down? Yo. I mean, yo. yeah. 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 I hear you. But it's choppy. Yo. 
You can hear you know, Max, can you hear us? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I can hear you. Yeah. Part of what I was saying is once we turn the album in, they said it's still gonna take like Yeah. Nah, that's what's up. We've been working on this bitch for like fucking since well, I met you before I you know what I mean? Shit, it's been a long process. It's been in for four years. Yeah, man. We'll probably get shut down. Yeah. Nah, that's what's up. That's what's up. Well, shit. Y'all already know, man. Four finger ring is full total effect. Y'all make sure y'all tell a friend to tell a friend. This is the squad. Ain't nobody touching it. We Don't. coming for album of the year on everything. Ah, salute to y'all, man. Yeah, it's four. Mm-hmm.